think I finally found a good fossil. That, to me, looks like a bulla, um, a whale ear bone. Well, here's what I suspect is the bulla, a uh, tympanic bulla of a whale, so one of the, the large ear bones. They've got a number of ear bones. The two largest is the tympanic bulla and the periotic, or periotic. And this is what the bulla would look like, you know, outside of the, the rock. This Well, similar to this one at least. Let's quickly have a, a prep, see what's left of it there. And maybe we're lucky and part of the periotic is in there. Well, that came out really well, actually. There's quite a bit of it left inside the rock here. I was worried that it might only be a sliver. But yeah, there, there's quite a bit in there. You can see on the edges here, lots of fractures. I had to glue those back together because they were going to fall off. And there's a little bit of crushing damage underneath there. I don't know if you can see. But right inside there, that's been crushed a little bit. Well, yeah, overall, a very nice whale ear bone. I did notice on this side, there's almost like veining in the rock over here, which looks to be, well, right on the inside of where the whale ear bone was. So this might almost be the mold of the whale ear bone here. Yeah, and there's a little bit of bone in there. So we might have quite a bit of information here. So if we take... This part over here as being the, the steinkern, the stony center of the bone. If we, yeah, if we 3D scan this, you might be able to reconstruct quite a bit of the, the whale ear bone here. Because, yeah, that definitely looks like the inside surface continuing here. That's pretty cool. I haven't seen that before. I always have a look at this book for anything whale and dolphin related and they've got a really nice diagram over here of that's the bulla over there you can see that's the piece and uh, we found now and that's the periotic over there so they normally attached but they come apart quite easily 
which is why you can find them separate like like this one and if you see all these little um, the points the data points over here you can use those to figure out what kind of whale or dolphin you have and to kind of show you where these ear bones sit this is a odontocete or a whale with teeth a cetacean with teeth and that's the front over there so the front of the jaw and then if you go all the way to the back of the skull that's where the periotic is sitting right at the back there tucked in underneath and there's the bulla sitting kind of on top Well, that was a super fun prep. You couldn't ask for a better matrix than that. The matrix was soft, the fossil was in great condition, and there was really good separation. You could see how easily that sediment came apart from the fossil. I didn't have to do too much at all. The only thing you could have asked for is that there was more of the ear bone over there, but there might be enough there to kind of get like an idea of what kind of whale it was. Maybe not down to a species level, but maybe at least a genus or, you know, slightly higher than that. Ear bones from whales and dolphins are super important fossils, so this fossil will be going off to the museum. Stay safe and I'll see you on the next hunt.